Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This week I wanted to do a review on Zahra the Label and I'm gonna go ahead and put a little disclaimer. She is one of my really close friends. However, I will be very honest in this review. I have so many pieces from her. Some that I bought myself, some that she's gifted as a friend. So I feel like I have a really good opinion about the brand and I want to continue doing more of these. So if you have a modest fashion brand that you are interested in knowing more about before you purchase from them, like Hot Hijab, Culture Hijab, Modernisa, let me know down below and I'll do a full review. So I'm so excited about this review. Okay, I'm gonna start off with her clothing. It's one of the things that I love the most about her brand. I feel like she really does cater to modest fashion. I have on one of her cardigans right now. This is probably Nah, I wouldn't say my first favorite, my second favorite piece. My first favorite piece, I'll show you guys in a second. This cardigan is literally the perfect long maxi cardigan for any modest gal, especially hijabis. I especially love how thick the fabric is. So it's not great for summer, but it's perfect for fall and winter. It's a super thick sweater material. And I especially love the sleeves. Like, she did such a great job. They're statement balloon sleeves, and I really feel like it makes the cardigan look so much more luxurious and just like, not boring. It's out of stock right now, unfortunately, but I think she is restocking it. So this is just one of the clothing pieces I love. The second piece of clothing that I absolutely adore is her cord set. I think this is called the Amira cord set. And oh my God, this was one of the first pieces I got from her. And that's when I instantly fell in love with the brand. It's just the most beautiful, like classy cord set. Like I don't know how to describe it. It's a long tunic top with a tie waist um, little thingy in the front. I love the rib detailing. The color is just perfect and it comes with the most beautiful like flare pants. And it's just, it's like every Modest Girls cord set dream. It's so stunning. So I do know she's gonna bring this back in stock next fall, I believe. The fit is great, the quality is great, and honestly, all of her clothing pieces, the quality is phenomenal. I've never had a problem where I've either purchased or received a um, outfit from her, and I'm like, oh, this is poor quality. Another piece I have from her is this Brianna dress, and it's gorgeous. Again, she nailed it with the quality. It's fully lined, so I don't have to worry about it being see-through. It's double lined. She has statement sleeves on majority of her outfits. It's a great, beautiful length. Um, I feel like I have another dress from her. I just can't find it at the moment, but this is one of her dresses. Again, I don't know if she's gonna be bringing this one back in stock, but at least you guys know that all of her clothing is phenomenal quality. So I think that's pretty much all I have for clothing. Oh, I do have one more thing. I guess this counts as clothing, right? So this is a prayer set from her, and oh my god. I'm not even kidding. The amount of uh, people who have asked me about this prayer set and her is absolutely insane. There was one video of mine that went viral on TikTok, and I was wearing this prayer set in it. It's this beautiful satin fabric, and it has like this beautiful ruffle detailing at the bottom. Um, it fits beautifully. The one thing I will say about this, so I love the quality. The fabric is phenomenal, it's very luxurious, but it is satin, so it does slip, obviously. Any satin fabric would slip, but oh, I wear this every single day, no joke. I pray in this every single day, and I love it so much and she is bringing this back in stock in Ramadan in a few colors so I feel like I'm giving out all of her release dates and secrets but I'm sure she'll be fine with it. Also by the way I feel like I need to say this too I didn't have a pre-chat with Zahra before I started filming this she has no idea what I'm gonna say I'm um, all I mentioned to her was like I'm gonna do a ZTL review and she was just like okay I'm sure she's nervous as well so I just hope you guys know it's a true honest haul review whatever Moving into her hijabs and accessories, I feel like this is what she's known for, like her $5.99 basic essential hijabs is what kind of goes viral. Um, I actually never tried that, or maybe I've tried one of them. I just know it's a thicker fabric, and personally, I like my chiffons to be a little bit more lightweight because I like the flow of it better, but I know a ton of people like her basics. I just can't speak to it. However, I can speak to her premium collection, is, which is what I have on today. I have the shade Walnut on. And I love her premium. Her premium is phenomenal. It is a little bit thicker than like hot hijab and, um, well, only hot hijab. That's the only one I've tried. But it's still a great chiffon fabric. I especially love this color because I feel like she nailed it with this color on brown skin tone. I feel like it just looks really, really pretty. Her chiffon scrunchies. This, I don't know if she still sells. So 
I hope she does because I'm just mentioning it. I have two of them. I have one on right now and then I have this black one. So I have a nude and a black and I wear this every single day. So I wear her scrunchies every single day. I wear her prayer set every single day. Um, and then the, she has her ninja undercaps, which I also really, really love. Great quality, super buttery soft. And I think she has them in like three, four different styles. You can do like the ninja style. You can do just like the, the tube cap. And she has a couple other. I only have her, I think it was the Fatima under cap. Um, I love it. I just don't wear it as much because I'm not one of the type of person who wants like their neck covered, but it is really, really great. My little sister actually wears it all the time. <laughs> I gave that to her. I think, I think that's one of the things Zahra gifted to me and I really loved it, but I was like, oh, I don't wear like neck coverage. So I give it to my sister and she loves it. So that was my review. I feel like I had a lot to say. Overall, 10 out of 10 for ZTL. Love the brand. Oh, the last thing I wanted to mention, she has like these beautiful like loungewear sets. So she has like an oversized sweatshirt and sweatpants and oh my God, I wanted it so bad. So bad, you guys. And I couldn't get my hands on it before it sold out. But when I went to California to visit her, I did wear hers. And I was just like, what is this? It's a dream. It was the best quality. It was so soft. It was like fleece lined, I think, inside. It was just like buttery soft inside. It was like so cuddly soft. It was definitely on the thicker side. So it keeps you really warm. Um, so it'd be best only in wintertime. But yeah, this set was gorgeous. I'll put a few pictures here. But yeah, that was my review. Um, five stars for ZTL. Let me know. Have you guys shopped there? Do you like it? Do you have bad experiences, good experiences? Down below in the comments. And then also... Let me know which other modest brand I should review next. I'm just like into this right now. And I want my videos to be helpful. Like I want you guys to either like learn tips from me or gain some knowledge or gain some insight in the whole hijab realm or modest fashion realm. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.